What's up everybody, it's Critical. I'm playing Classroom Aquatic for the PC. Let's do this shit. I don't even know how to play, I've got this. Pop quiz. Enough said, I guess. That was an easy quiz. Thank you, teacher. Let's take a look around, alright. Shamu's up at the chalkboard, that's terrific. Turning around like something out of a fucking horror film, that's awesome. I've decided to give you Hey, stop stretching! Show the professor some respect! It's just a general overview, nothing too difficult. You have five minutes to answer ten questions. I'll be walking around the classroom to make sure we don't have any cheating. You may begin. You test now. How about you work on your grammar, professor, before you can try and hand me quizzes, you bitch? What type of epithelium lines the urinary bladder and is capable of distension? Anatomy and physiology one, bitch. You're asking the right man. Cuboidal epithelium is, uh, secretion and absorption, so that's not gonna be the bladder. Squamous epithelium is usually found in places with rapid diffusion or filtration, so like kidneys, that's not going to be bla the bladder. Columnar, that's also secretion and absorption. Transitional epithelium, you sack of shit. It's definitely transitional because I remember that one stretches, so it's going to be found in the urinary bladder. Professor, you're making this too easy for me, I'm sorry to say. I don't even fucking need to cheat. My goodness. You know what the fuck you got over there, eh? Stupid piece of shit. It's transitional- what the fuck? What are you coming over here with an attitude for? I got it right! I didn't even fucking cheat! Go over there and give him the business. He's over there putting fucking cuboidal like an amateur. I mean, it's not his fault that he's been thrown to the wolves. You should have taught him better. He should know that cuboidal epithelium is found on the ovarian surface, not the urinary bladder. Do your job, professor. How do I go to the next question? Submit answers? Yeah, I guess so. I know it's the right answer. Hell yeah, I'm sure it's the right answer. The fuck is this? There was more than one question? What am I taking, the bar exam here? This is outrageous. Damn right I want to play again. I'm gonna give this quiz the truth. Yeah, I gotta fucking- Oh my fucking goodness, it's a shapeshifter. Oh, what the fuck? They're all changing colors on me right now. What is this? You have the answer to this over there on that pop quiz, huh? You? What about you? I'm just crawling on the desk now, but yeah, I'll fucking crawl on this desk. How do you like this, peers? Fellow classmates, do you like me? I'm a fucking barbarian on this desk. How do you like this? Rub my fucking scrotum all over this quiz. Oh, they're switching the questions up on me now. All right, they wouldn't dare ask me more anatomy and physiology questions. In Marcel Proust, In Search of Lost Time, who did Charles Swan marry? How am I supposed to know this? This is science fiction. I thought this was a pop quiz, not a pop shit. You got the answer over there, buddy? Not even taking the same quiz as me. All right, that doesn't help. Neither does that poster with the toga kiss on it. That doesn't motivate me. Professor, I'm cheating on the student to my left. Wish me luck. He says B. I can live with B. Odette de Crecy. How do I go to the next question? Without submitting the answers for the whole test. This is the real quiz. How the fuck do I do this? Spank my asshole with your ass cheeks. Damn it. No, I don't want to submit answers. I want the next question. What did I just hit? What was that? Q? Yeah, it was Q. Q. Got it. All right. Um, alright. Q and E, it seems. Alright, fair enough, fair enough. The Egyptian New Kingdom complex shown below was constructed for... I'm actually pretty sure it's Emotep. Emotep was a pretty big name in Egypt at one point in time. He was also the antagonist in The Mummy, and The Mummy is actually my favorite movie, so... Emotep it is. The slope of the staircase is referred to as its... Well, the slope is rise over run, y equals mx plus b, but... That's not... That's none of these here. Alright, cheating again, professor. Alright. No one's on the same question as me. I guess I'll just go ahead and rip my nipples off. Is this guy on the same question as me over here? Yes, he is. He says C. Alright, C. Can I get more confirmation? He's on the Egyptian question. He's reading a newspaper. That doesn't help me. I'll just go with C. Fuck it. Pitch line. That works for me. I can live with that. Only he who forswears love's power could win the world's wealth for his own is a quote from which of Wagner to Ring des Nibulus the operas. Well, Professor, you can eat my rectum. What do you got over here, buddy? What do you say? Oh, fuck you too then. Oh yeah, just flex on me. Yeah, just flex on me. That'll teach me. Oh, hello, Professor. Trust me, there's no fishy business going on over here. Just, uh, yeah, keep patrolling. Shove my face in your ass is what I'm gonna do. Does somebody have the answer, please? Come on, gentlemen.
Help me out. I'm just going to go Siegfried. Fuck it. Siegfried and Roy. Sounds good to me. In 5th century BCE, Blank proposed that the universe was composed of fundamental and invari invariant atoms. I don't even know these names. Who are these? Who is Pliny the Elder? Sounds like a retired Smurf prostitute. What are, you getting, what are you getting all angry about? I didn't even do anything. You think you've lost your marbles, Professor? You're not even looking at me, Professor. I see your pupils. You're looking at the ceiling. Yeah, just run away. You'll never make it in cross country. Uh, this is just ridiculous. Alright, I mean... If that's how you want to play ball... I'll play ball. Alright. Fuck you got over here. Oh, Alright, yeah, cover up your answers. Thanks, buddy. Thanks, pal. He says A. I don't even know if he's on the same question as me. It really doesn't matter. I'll go with A. Blank's eponius equations describe how electric charges and electric currents create electric and magnetic fields. I want to say it's James Clerk Maxwell because that name kind of sounds familiar. I try and cheat, but my classmates aren't team players. This photograph, believed to be the first ever photograph of a living human, was accidentally taken by my ass. The average gestation period for a sperm whale is blank days. Haven't brushed up on my sperm whale trivia, unfortunately. What is the name of the Phineas Fogg's trusty valet in Around the World in 80 Days? John Passport 2, I remember that. Fucking Jackie Chan, baby. Uh, that's right. I remember that movie. Can't fool me. The painting below, com Composition 7, is an example of neoplasticism by... Probably my ass. Alright. No, oh, he's on the same quote. What do you got? Alright, thanks for uh, making that really difficult to see. Perfect. What about you? I think he said D. I couldn't tell, but you know what? I'll go D. I have no better answers. The only thing I could do is just slap my titties on the table and hope the professor's impressed and just give me the A. I'm gonna go with James Clerk Maxwell for this one. I'm gonna go fuck myself for this one. Professor, I have a, I have a question. Professor. Professor. Alright. Alright, Professor. Fine. Answer his question and not mine. Alright, whatever works for you then. What do you got? Not on the same question as me, but... You said D for that. I went with A. Hey, Professor, I have a quiz for you. Am I A, thinking of you? B, looking at you? C, tickling you? Or D, about to cream myself in front of you? I didn't even do anything, Professor! If I even move from my seat, you throw a tantrum? That's just ridiculous. Alright, perfect. 5 out of 10 is not bad, though. I didn't answer, like, 3 of those. I, I would have really liked to know the gestation, gestation period for a sperm whale, though. I feel like that could have benefited me. That knowledge could have been really helpful. Alright, well, I'm done playing this. Well, that's the end of this video. Remember to rate the video, comment the video, and subscribe if you want to see videos similar to this one. See ya.